Hey guys, uh, welcome back. So now, here in this session, we'll see another common error, and the error is this one. Please enter the required conditions. This error actually has taken place while creation of purchase order. And if you talk about the root cause of this error that is coming from MM side, so here we'll see the solutions, but we'll not go into much detail because that is coming from retail management side. Right, so now here, let me do one thing. This error is appearing at the time of creation of material master, sorry, uh, purchase order. So, give a vendor here. Let me set up a purchase order, I'll show you guys. So I'll give material master here. Quantity, a particular date, and a price. A plant, storage locations, everything is fine. Check the. So if you click on condition here. So look at here, one error is appearing. Please enter required conditions, right? Or is here also you can see, now all of a sudden this, you click here, red color. No. So the error is, please enter the required condition. So this is all about what guys, this is like related to this conditions. Look at here, certain condition types are appearing here. And this is related to the pricing procedure, middle management pricing procedure, which is called schema, right? So what we have to do now, those pricing procedure related settings are going to be done by MM consultant only, but I'll tell you guys a very simple solution there. It means certain condition types are there, which is, I think, maybe made by, uh, you know, somebody from MM side might have made that as a required you just go to slash n and then give m slash 08 that is the transaction code and use the standard schema your pricing procedure whatever you say so that is like this one where it is rm rm double zero double zero there is the standard which is triggered always double click on control so yes look at here for gross price we are having two different condition type one is pb00 and second one is pb double x right so here what is happening look at here this is called required so both are required right now here what is happening both are required but only one is appearing that is PBXX is appearing, so it is saying like if you give PB00 here and press enter. Okay, I'll give you 100. Then what is happening? Yes. So then also this error is going to be solved, or is generally what happened, guys? You can do one thing, you can remove anyone. Let's suppose here I have removed one required. Because anyway, PBXX was appearing here by default. Now, what will happen, guys? It is going to be solved. But here, PB00 have entered. So now, what is happening? So if I do one thing, go to slash and every 21 and and here. So. No need to enter two different condition type for the same gross price case. It's just do one thing. So we have material quantity. Okay, come down. Condition. And you can delete PB00. Even if you delete right now, why? Because we have made it optional. So now there is no error. Earlier, when PBXX was there, 
there was error but right now there is no error click here everything is fine save it let your order got created so simply it means required conditions miss in pricing procedure what is happening that condition type two different condition type was there that was made as a required by someone anyway it's a practice survey it happens because multiple people are doing multiple settings right so from mm side somebody might have made this experiment and because of that this error has taken place so simply whatever i shown here you have to make it even if you want to remove this one also you can remove and you can make it both as a optional only okay and then also you can proceed further 